Some of the most controlled, quiet, and logical individuals you'll ever meet are members of the Sigma fraternity. They have a reputation for being able to remain calm under pressure and even diffuse tense circumstances. It is actually not surprising that he is able to always stay so centered and can always take the high road, even if that means cutting off all contact with someone who is displaying, considering that he is a lone wolf and does not pay any mind to the expectations and judgments of society and the people in it. On the other hand, there is a bit more nuance to it than that. Therefore, in today's video, we are going to discuss 10 strategies that the Sigma male use when confronted with impolite individuals. Number 1. He doesn't get sucked in. The Sigma will typically choose to dismiss a nasty reaction when confronted with it for the first time, at least in the beginning. Whether it is someone he cares about or not, it may depend on the person who is being unpleasant to him as well as the frequency with which it occurs. And despite the fact that each can eventually cause the Sigma to react in a way that is slightly unique and thoughtful, the one thing that does not change is the way in which he does not let himself get pulled into the drama. If it's someone he isn't particularly close to or has no reason to keep on good terms with, then it's possible that he will not respond and will simply remove himself from the situation in order to avoid further interaction with them. On the other hand, even if it is someone close to him, he will not get drawn in or be reactive to their impertinence since he will not allow himself to get provoked. He will let him to be impolite, allow him to finish throwing their fit, and then ignore it until they have calmed down. If necessary, he will then address the matter in a reasonable manner. Number 2. He contemplates the reason behind it. Before reacting to something, the stigma loves to think about everything from every viewpoint and examine every possibility. If he is dealing with someone who is being unpleasant, the first thing he will do is examine what the other person's goal is. And where exactly this response is stemming from. Is the individual in question being impolite on purpose, or are they simply oblivious to the impression they're giving? At other instances, it may be more difficult to ascertain, whereas other times, it may be very clear. Therefore, the stigma will typically err on the side of caution and do his best to assume, at least initially, that his opponent does not plan to be impolite. However, he may require some additional information before he chooses how best to manage the situation and how to go to the next. He is more likely to give others the benefit of the doubt, but when it is patently evident that he is dealing with full-on rudeness, that can influence the way he plays the game. Number 3. He engages in a considerable amount of self-reflection. If the Sigma understands that the other person is, in fact, being impolite, he will take a moment to distance himself from the situation, withdraw into his thoughts, and attempt to rationally analyze whether or not there is a good reason for him to be on the receiving end of this impolite behavior. Did he make a mistake in some way? Or perhaps the other person was offended by him in some way? Is today proving to be an especially trying one for them? Have you finally snapped, and he simply happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time? Is this an isolated incident or do you typically behave in this manner? Are they green with envy because of him? Have there been any other warning signs that could shed light on why they are acting so impolitely? Since the Sigma frequently engages in introspection and contemplation of the world around him, he will make use of this ability to help him maintain as much composure as is humanly possible, which will enable him to respond in the manner that is best suited to the circumstance. Say, number 4, he feels compassion for the person involved if they are someone he cares about. To get to the bottom of the matter and have a good knowledge of what the other person is going through, the one sending the empathic signal will attempt to put themselves in the position of the other person. He will never fail to show sympathy and sensitivity in his actions. Also, make an effort to empathize with what it is that they are going through. This does not imply that he is excusing their inappropriate behavior in any way, but it may be of assistance to them in gaining a more objective viewpoint and gaining some clarity on the matter. The Sigma is not the type of person who thinks on such a low level, yet it does not mean that there are not times when it is absolutely needed. The proof is what sustains the Sigma. Honey is more effective than vinegar at catching flying insects. He is aware that the most favorable outcome will always be one in which he maintains his politeness, calmness, and composure rather than striking back with rudeness and episodes that are reciprocated. Number 5. He is contemplating the best way to deal with the matter. As soon as he has taken an unbiased look at all of the particulars of the scenario, including the seriousness and frequency of the rudeness, the alleged motivation for it, and the action that would be in his best interest to do, he will decide how he should respond. He is required to contemplate whether or not it would be beneficial for him to respond in any way. 
Is there anything positive that could come from engaging in such behavior? Does the behavior seem to follow a certain pattern? After giving these considerations a lot of thought, he then moves on to thinking about how he is going to manage the problem going forward after giving it a lot of thought. As individuals, each of us is composed of numerous tiers, and there are plenty of instances in which it may be challenging to comprehend the words and acts of one another. Therefore, this is something that will constantly be taken into consideration by the sigma. Because the sigma is a multifaceted individual, there is no cookie-cutter approach that can be taken when considering how to react. After first disregarding the outburst in question, it will react in one of several different ways once the dust has cleared on the situation. Number 6. He has a direct line of communication. Even if he does not completely cut off all communication, he will not reply in any way. In lieu of that, he chose to walk away and make the decision to never respond to this person again, particularly if this person is more of a stranger or an acquaintance, and particularly if he believed that the rudeness was unjustified or if it is a friend that he hasn't known for that long. It's possible that he won't respond even after the event. But don't close the door on the possibility of reconciliation. Give the other person the chance to recognize their error and make amends with you by reaching out to you. And if they don't, well, that's their prerogative. You can't force them to do anything. If, on the other hand, it is someone with whom he has a long-standing relationship, someone who cares profoundly about him, and someone who he is especially close to and with whom he shares a strong tie, he may very well make the decision to reach out to them. He will confront them in person and, in a level-headed manner, explain why his experience was negatively impacted by their impolite behavior at that moment, while while being able to convey his unflinching regard and enduring affection for them. Number 7. He gives them a hearing. The Sigma is a skilled communicator who gives careful consideration to the words that he chooses. When he comes to the conclusion that he must engage in some form of antagonistic interaction with a person who is important to him in some way, However, rather than a direct confrontation, this is more of an approach. However, another aspect of what makes H. Im such a good communicator is not just the way in which he plans to express how he is feeling, but also the manner in which he listens to what the other person has to say. The Sigma might default is an excellent listener and understands how to actively listen, which indicates that while he is doing so, he not only maintains a reasonable, caring, and open mind in the process. In addition to this, he takes note of the other person's nonverbal cues, demonstrates that he is paying attention, and then gives the necessary feedback or answer. There will be no interruptions from him. Before he takes the time to think about how he would respond to something, he will always choose to listen to what someone else has to say first. Number 8. Makes an effort to diffuse the tension in the situation. A mechanism that helps calm down otherwise tense situations on its own. If, throughout the course of the confrontation, Things start to get hot to the point where the person expresses discomfort, the signal will continue to remain calm and composed. Additionally, it will continue to transmit respect while keeping its attention on the core of the matter. He will speak in a manner that is not confrontational in an effort to soothe the aggressor. Body language that doesn't invite conflict, and allowing his words and actions to foster an environment that's reassuring to be in. Before attempting to find a solution to the issue, you should probably give the other person some room to breathe and some time to cool down. He will address the concerns and empathize with those affected to the best of his ability, but if the circumstance continues to deteriorate, he will not be responsible. When the Sigma realizes that he is not progressing in the conversation, he will make the choice to once more establish his limits and withdraw from the interaction. After that, he will go back to the phase where he considers what transpired and re-evaluates the circumstance before moving on to the next stage of deciding what he will do next. Number 9. Because the Sigma male has a great deal of respect for himself, he establishes limits. He is quite concerned with delineating limits. He is crystal clear about the things that he will not tolerate in any form. It's much simpler to say than to actually do. It may be challenging for many people to take this step but doing so is absolutely necessary in order to demonstrate the level of self-awareness you possess. And as a result, showing other people how they should treat you in order to get the treatment they deserve. This will not only increase the amount of respect others have for you, but it will also increase the amount of respect you have for yourself. When dealing with rude people, the Sigma prefers to set an initial boundary by politely letting them know that he doesn't want to engage and will remove himself from the situation. This will not only increase the amount of respect others have for you, 
but it will also increase the amount of respect you have for yourself. Which is the first step in drawing a clear line and making his limits clear to the other party. On top of that, the kinds of individuals that don't respect his limits aren't typically the kind of people he wants to have around anyhow. Now, before we share our final point on how Sigma males respond to rude people, we ask that if you've made it this far and during doing the content, then please assist us in expanding our community by liking the video and sharing it with your friends. If you've made it this far and during doing the content, then you've done the content. I really appreciate your help. We are appreciative of each and every one of you. Number 10. He does not compromise who he is for anyone. On the other hand, the scenario plays out with whoever it was that behaved in an impolite, unpleasant, or brazen manner toward him. In the end, the Sigma won't ever permit himself to feel an excessive amount of distress, and he won't. Never stop moving forward. Hi. S feelings may have been injured in some manner, but he is incredibly self-assured, and what he believes about himself is not dependent on the opinions or input of other people. Despite the fact that his feelings may have been damaged, he is extremely self-assured. He has a firm grasp on his identity and is completely at peace with himself. The stigma, like the rest of us, is not perfect, but he accepts his shortcomings and considers them to be an integral part of who he is and finds ways to work on them to progress and evolve as a man and as a human being, which is what he seeks to do every day, which is exactly what this sentence means. He doesn't let unpleasant interactions affect his life or the priorities he has set for himself, and he is able to let go of things when necessary. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And do share with your friends so we may continue to create them. To see more videos like this, subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Additionally, make sure to check out our other videos. Thank you for watching.